This is pure aqua Italian sparkling mineral water. It costs 99 cents and we bought it at Aldi. This says the pH and TDS levels. Let's pour some water in. First, we're going to test the TDS level. But at first, let's stir it a little so we'll get a better result. If you want to buy this TDS tester, check the link down below. Turn on the TDS tester, make sure it says zero, and put it in. It's in the 200s. That is average tap water. Now let's test the pH level. If you want to buy this pH tester, check the link down below. Only do two drops. Let's stir it a little for a better result. I'm giving this a 5.5. This is acidic. Stay tuned, like and subscribe. This is Joritos Mineragua Water. It's sourced from Mexico and it costs one fifty. Let's test the pH and TDS levels. Let's pour some water in. Let's stir it a little so we'll get a better result on the TDS. If you want to buy this TDS tester, the link's down below. Turn on the TDS tester. Make sure it says zero and put it in. It is in the 100s. That is okay to drink. Now let's test the pH level. If you want to buy this pH tester, the link's down below too. Only do two drops. Let's also stir this with the other side so we'll get a better result. I give this a 5. This is a acidic. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe. This is LaCroix Sparkling Water. We got it with a pack of six and it costed it $4.19. Let's test the pH and TDS levels. It's sourced from the USA. First, let's test the TDS level. But let's first stir a little so we'll get a better result. If you want to buy this TDS tester, check the link down below. Turn on the TDS tester, make sure it says zero, and put it in. 21. That is ideal drinking water. Now let's test the pH level. If you want to buy this pH tester, check the link down below. Only do two drops. Let's stir it a little for a better result. I give this a 5. I give this a 4.5. This is acidic. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe.
This is raw sparkling artesian water from Norway. It cost three dollars, and remember we tested another Voss. It was the still version. This is the sparkling version, and let's see how it compares to the still version. Um, the still version was twenty five TDS. And the pH level was 4.5. Let's see how they compare. Let's pour some water in. This is a little too much for the pH cup. Let's pour some back in the TDS. And we're going to test the TDS level first. But let's stay a little so we'll get a better result on the TDS. If you want to buy this TDS tester, the link's down below. Turn on the TDS tester, make sure it says zero, and let's put it in. It is in the 100s. Now we're going to test the T pH level. It's okay to drink. And if you want to buy this Aquion pH tester, the link's down below. I'm going to do two drops. Let's stir a little with the other side so we'll get a better result. I give this a 5.5. This is acidic. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe. This is Kirkland Italian Sparkling Mineral Water. It's sold at Costco in a box of 24. It's sourced from Italy. Let's test the pH and TDS levels. Let's pour some water in. First, we're going to test the TDS level. But at first, let's stir it a little so we'll get a better result. If you want to buy this TDS tester, check the link down below. Turn on the TDS tester, make sure it says zero, and put it in. It is in the 200. That is okay to drink. And it's average tap water. Now let's test the pH level. If you want to buy this pH tester, check the link down below. Only do two drops. Let's stir it a little for a better result. I give this a 5.5. This is acidic. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe. This is Tapu Chico Mineral Water, and it's from Mexico. It costs $1.29. Let's open it so we can... So we can test the TDS level and pH level. Let's put a poison back in because it's a little too much. Let's do the TDS level first. Make sure it says zero. Put it in and that's fine. It's average tap water. Now let's test the pH level. Two drops only. It's orange. 
I give it a five. That's on one more drop because it's a little too much. It's orange. So it's five point five. This is San Pellegrino Sparkling Natural Mineral Water. Its product of Italy and it costs $2.50. Let's pour some in to see the TDS and pH. First, we're gonna test the TDS. Turn on the TDS tester. Make sure it says zero and put it in. It is average tap water. Now let's test the pH level. It is orange. That means it is acidic. This is Perrier Sparkle Natural Mineral Water. It's from France and it costs one dollar and sixty-nine cents. Let's pour some in so we can test the TDS level and pH. First, let's test the TDS level. Turn on the TDS tester and make sure it says here. Put it in and let's put it in. One. Let's wait till it stops. One hundred. Two hundred fifty. Let's test the pH level so we can wait while we wait. One. It is close to five.
Let's say tilt this. Two hundred thirty four. That is marginally acceptable. This is liquid depth sparkling water from the Austrian Alps. It's sold at Whole Foods Market for $169. Let's test the pH and TDS levels. Let's pour some water in. First, let's test the TDS level. Turn on the TDS tester. Make sure it says zero and put it in. It's around the 100. This is carbon filtered mountain spring or aquifers. Now let's test the pH level. Only do two drops. I give this a five. This is acidic. Stay tuned, like and subscribe. This is Mountain Valley's and spring water. It's sparkling water and it's source from Arkansas. Remember we tested the still version of this? Its TDS was 189 and its pH was 8.5. Let's see how this compares. It costs one forty nine. Let's pour some water in. First, we're going to test the TDS out, but before, let's stir it a little so we'll get a better result. Turn on the TDS tester. Make sure it says zero and put it in. It's inside the 100s. That is okay to drink. If you want to buy this TDS tester, check the link down below. If you want to buy this pH tester, check the link down below. Only do two drops. Let's stir it a little for a better result. I give this a five. This is acidic. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe.